you're looking at the daytime footage of the Bullet HD Biker Pro camera. There is a little bit of lens flare you can see from the sun, but the daytime footage is spectacularly crisp and clear, as you can see from this individual camera frame that I've grabbed from the video. The uh, image is extremely clear. The shutter speed is very high, obviously. Now, riding directly into the sun, uh, the image is not washed out. The camera does not overcompensate for that sun. Now, with the sun off to the side, the daytime footage is obviously excellent. The exposure is amazing. Uh, when you go underneath the shadows of the trees, as you can see here, other cameras have a, a huge problem underexposing, overexposing back and forth with the shadows. This camera seems to adjust very quickly, even with the sun peeking in from the corner. There's just no problem. The, the image is perfect. Now, riding directly into the sun, I'm almost blind at this point, but the camera sees, in fact, this camera footage here is seeing a lot more than I was actually seeing while I was riding uh, on this route. Now we're at dusk, you can actually see my headlight on the road. It looks uh, much brighter in this image than it actually was. The uh, image, the, the actual ride at this point was quite dark. Um, and yet the camera is picking up the, uh, the uh, image and making it look almost like daytime. Uh, the only indication that it is not is that you can actually see the outline of my headlights and my driving lights on the road ahead of me. So the dusk uh, pickup of this video camera is excellent. Now nighttime we are riding at extremely dark rural roads and it is very very dark at this time of night. As you can see, the, uh, even with headlights of oncoming cars, um, the exposure is excellent. In fact, once again, the camera is seeing quite a bit more than I could at this time of night. However, the shutter speed is obviously quite a bit longer because of this low exposure. As a result, when you see the, uh, I'll, I'll do an image grab here, um, and you can see that it's not quite cr crisp and clear as it was in the middle of the daytime. You can see quite a bit of blurring. Uh, as there is movement because of the long shutter speeds at this point. However, that said, riding at nighttime in the pitch dark, uh, even with these uh, HID lights I've got on here, uh, is excellent. It lights up trees, it, it, it's showing things that I could not even see myself with my own eyes while riding at night. Urban nighttime riding is uh, again excellent we have a little bit more light because of the headlights and so on and you'll see an excellent example of someone almost cutting me off here this woman here I had to stop and, and uh, the woman didn't see me and and at the last second stopped and, and stopped turning left in front of me there but as you can see the uh, urban lighting lighting up the environment such that the uh, camera picks up quite a bit more light and is again excellent